What's the first thing you do when you get up in the morning, Leslie? A poo. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> really? There's <laughs> honesty. That's great. Honesty. I told you she's a straight that speaker. That is going to play talker. beautifully yeah. in LA. <laughs> yeah. Mine's probably putting my lenses in to make sure that it's actually Leslie. That, uh... <laughs> <laughs> that you're still married to. Yeah. Depends whether it's Paddy McGinty or not. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, that's right. I don't like looking at an Irishman next to me in bed. Next next question. Fill in the blank. Performance is? Uh, everything that you've practised, everything that you've done and learned to have the best chance of it coming out unhindered is by staying in the moment. So that's the, I think that's the secret to performance. Facing your deepest fears. Oh, that's good. Well, this is a good next question. Simon, what scares you? Karaoke, interactive dinner theatre, or being brought up onto stage for any reason to do something. <laughs> Anything I'm not prepared for paralyses me. <laughs> I'm most scared of not having passion. Yeah. Okay, this next question is a good one. You can't say each other, but what do you love? Chocolate. I mean, truly. I mean, I love it. Melted chocolate. I've often thought to myself, you know, if I had to choose a way of dying, it would be to die in a vat of melted chocolate. For me, I think it's uh, probably laughing and fun. OK, well, this is a good next question, given where you find yourselves now. Leslie, first celebrity crush? Ewan McGregor. Without uh -oh. a of a doubt, I'm desperate to meet him. <laughs> Joanne Wally was my first, I think, crush that I remember. <laughs> The actress. Not many people get to meet their celebrity crushes. I feel like you two might. Next question. Yeah, tell us one thing that nobody knows about you, Leslie. That I'm a messy crier. What does that mean? So, mm. lots of snot. <laughs> they probably wouldn't know. Yeah, yeah. For me, well, I grew up in Africa. I mean, know that. Um, what is your favourite number and why? For me, it's the number four because it was my mum's favourite number. <laughs> Um, and I adopted it when I was young because I love my mum so much that I wanted to do everything like her. Mine, I think, is seven. Uh, it's, the, it's the number I played playing uh, football uh, and my birthday's on the 14th. It's a multiple of seven. Sevens have always been my, my lucky number. Uh, what do you wish you'd learn sooner? Um, to not worry about what other people think. Mm -hmm. It's probably mine too. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. That's a good one. What's on your bucket list? Probably to go to Japan. Yeah, that's Actually, mine. We were talking about that. Both, both of us is to go to Japan. We'd love to travel there. And jump out of an aeroplane. Or maybe I could do the two together. I could go to Japan and, and jump yeah. out of an aeroplane. Jump out of a plane. Preferably not jump out of a plane to get to Japan. <laughs> <laughs> okay, nearly there. Uh, what's the most boring thing ever? People with no sense of humour. Uh, being forced to sit through a film that you hate. What is your favourite position in bed? And I do need to clarify that it's a sleeping position. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. I'm going to say. Else, it's not as paddy. It's a bit paddy. Um, it's, mine is, is, is I put, I hug a pillow and uh, cross my legs. So I'm, yeah. I'm a side sleeper. Uh, so I love sleeping on the side, yeah. When you say cross your legs, ow. Yeah, so like, you know, I, I kind of like, I'm on my side and I have one leg that's kind of sprawled out over the other like a scissor kick, you know? Pillows involved as well, presumably. I know, right? Well, that's just so that I can kick Sai when he snores. That's right. So stop me. After 21 years of marriage, right, it's the, I, the pillow used to be me. And now, I will say, if you know many endur elite endurance athletes, their metabolism is so high, so they're burning hot at night. They run really hot. So Leslie, you can barely touch her skin. She's red hot when she sleeps. <laughs> and in fairness, most couples prefer a pillow to a partner at this stage as well, because we do the same thing. That's right. <laughs> and if they don't, they haven't been married long enough. <laughs> Quite so. That makes us all feel better. Guys, thank you once oh, again. Right, right. Oh, thank both Thanks, of you. Thanks, team. Yeah.